Hello, this is me, Single Apple. I'm going to show you how to make a karaoke movie, nice and easy, free. All you need to do is add a title in Windows Movie Maker, and that's how we do it. So you change the wording to the first line of the song, once it's away. We go back to the home and to the title point, and we click that. And of course it puts the title to the front, so we need to move that to the second part of our song. Change the words again. And we simply proceed doing this throughout the song. Going back to the home page, adding a title, and moving it to the relevant place in the song. So I'm not going to do this all the way through the song, I'm just going to show you the first four lines. So we've moved that there, change the words, and again we'll do the last one. Now when we created the words we also want to add some music because we need to line these up. This is the fun part. So we're going to add some music any second. I'm just moving that because I don't think the words start immediately of the song. So I'm going to add the song. I'm going to play it now. Once there was a way to get back homeward. Once there was a way to get back. And then what you have to do is you have to realign the words so that they tally. With Once there was a way to get back home. So you just pull the words to the left. It's quite simple. Now, you really don't want the voice in there. So what we're going to do is use Audacity, which is a free piece of music software software tool. We're going to import the song and remove the words. So we play it just to hear what it sounds like. Once there was a way And then if we go into effects we should be able to remove the voice with that option there. save it. Now unfortunately it's not magic so it's not going to remove the voice perfectly um, but at least it will hopefully quieten the voice of the song down. So we'd save that and then when we've saved that as a WAV file we would then add that back into our Windows Movie Maker. And then we'll see what that sounds like. We can change some options. So let's animate this a little bit. That's just going to bring the words in. And now what we can do is we can also change the background colours if we want. 
They don't always have to be black. Pick whatever colour you want here. And then when we've changed all the colours we simply save the movie. So we'll simply just carry on adding some more colours. Uh, as I said you can put whatever colours you want here. You don't have to have them different if you don't want to. And finally, I'm just going to save the movie. So I hope that helped you. Thank you for watching.